guys, it's Max and Kim here back again. We've got something very special for you today. We got a new drone! So today we are gonna unbox it. What we'll also do in this video is compare it size wise to the Pro. Yeah. <gasps> Ooh. Wow, that's pretty cool. This is snazzy. Nice little compact bag. Don't know what's in it, but it's cute. So one sort of travel bag. That one's got the drone in it, I think. And then two mysterious black boxes. Do, 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 do. I'm guessing batteries are in here. Okay. Oh, cool. Ooh. And the controller. Oh, nice. New controller. And these little bits come off. So, oh, so with handy. the um, Pro, they were always on it. And so whenever you try to put it in the bag, they get stuck. Which is this. For propellers. We nice. don't need these. And charge a car charger? Wow, Battery the batteries are tiny. Uno, and they're What's so the... light. Really unsure as to what this is. Wow! <laughs> I don't know what this is either, but I like it. I also think this is a charger, so... Yeah, there are all those different types of chargers. So just a quick recap from the first black bag. So we've got the controller, toggles for the controller, propellers. Got all those charger cables, charger cables, battery charger, battery charger. Not too sure what this is yet. Maybe another battery charger. Two spare batteries. Dun, dun, dun. Ooh, hoo, hoo. Sleek. I'm just gonna... I'll take this out. This is the size of my hand. It folds up so small. I think it folds up even smaller than the, the DJI Spark. Because yeah, the, the spark, spark doesn't, doesn't fold up. I, we wanna... also got the black one. It does come in white and red, but we just liked the black yeah. one. Bags. It's quite similar. This one actually goes this way, but just for size wise, we'll have a look. Pro bag, Mavic Air bag. The Air bag's a lot stylier, but it is more material, so I don't know if it'll be as good if it gets wet or anything. It's really nice and light, where I think this one's a little bit heavier, but the drone is in it currently. Yeah, this is what we were talking about with the controllers, so. Mavic Air controller. And the Mavic Pro. So when you look at the size of the actual drones, the Mavic Air and the Mavic Pro. This is huge! So this still shoots in 4K, 60 frames per second. Important thing to note with this one is that these fold in. And the other difference is that the propellers, the don't. propellers don't actually fold. The propellers stay like that. The battery actually is in the bottom. So the battery clips out from underneath the drone. And then with the Pro, you unclip it at the top. We've got the back sensors, the bottom sensors, and then you've also got the front sensors as well. So that's the air folded up and, we'll just get and the, the Pro. Level. And it's the Pro. Horizontal view and yeah. So it folds up a lot smaller. Yeah, and it's so like so just, skinny where this one's not. Just to give you a comparison. <laughs> but our hands aren't the same size. So it's quite heavy as well. Can I hold that for a second? Oh. Oh wow, quite a bit lighter. Yeah. I guess so. So you could just slide the controller into the back there. And that's your drone with your controller ready to go. Where with the pro you <coughs> always have to take the whole bag. <laughs> Guys. Okay. So, originally when we bought the drone, I didn't think that you had a three-way or four-way charger because um, they all the ones that I'd looked at online. It didn't come with it. But, the little fly more combo that we got has... We figured it out! This! We can charge four batteries... at once! <laughs> what the heck?! Oh, this way! Figured it out! Don't worry guys, Tetris oh, is not cool. my... best game. This is so exciting! Get the air, guys. It is so cool. They just fit in here. Ow! Ooh, slick. Anyway, we're gonna charge everything and we'll be back with you very shortly. So Kim successfully synced the app with the drone. Ladies and gentlemen, we are in business. So step one on how to activate your Mavic Air. So the first thing we're gonna do is just remove the gimbal case. Slides up. Boom! This is the button for the battery, so you put the battery in and then we're just going to press the battery button there. So you hold, you press it and then you hold it in. 
so you'll hear the DJI noise and the lights will come on and there's the light at the back as well then what you want to do is go on your phone download the DJI app so you want to go into that and I'll open up into this and then what you want to make sure is whatever type of drone you have making sure you select it so we'll go into the Mavic Air today um, and then you can currently see it's disconnected so you want to enter device and you either have to connect to the aircraft or the camera view and we want to connect to it because we we're going to be flying it today we want to do a Wi-Fi connection and then it pretty much goes through the steps so what you do is unfold all of it you want to turn it on and then you go next and they just show you there how to turn it on and then what we do now is we actually need to connect to the Wi-Fi or you can scan the code so what you want to do is press and hold this function button at the back so you press and one, two, three, four, and then you can see there it comes up. Once you've done that, click join, and then it'll be connected. Now we have to activate it, um, and it just gives you another warning sign there to make sure that you've removed the little gimbal cover. Oh, and we are live. A nice looking wall you got there. <laughs> ah. Hey. How cool! Vlog exception. Where do I look? So now you can see the camera there, and we've got the GPS set up. So now the next thing to do is to take off. Uh, at the moment, we're just using the phone because we got too excited while the controller is still charging. Uh, but it makes it a lot easier if you do have the controller. What's step number one to calibrate it, Kim? You want to rotate the aircraft 360 degrees horizontally. Okay. Do 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 do. And now you want to rotate it 360 degrees vertically. Okay. Towards your ear. Perfect. Cool. So you'll you'll know when you can take off because it the goes green. Top left corner will say ready to go, and that means the GPS is linked. So we're gonna take off. Well, that was our first flight with the Mavic Air. <laughs> Hope you enjoyed Fun it. Flight, guys. Nah, for real though, we're going to take it outside now and do some tests. It's actually raining, so we're not going to do it. But we today. might go out tomorrow when it's sunny. Yeah, then we'll show you guys. We're going to take it for a spin. Because <laughs> <laughs> the propellers spin. It's funny. <laughs> anyway, see you tomorrow. Yep, see you. <laughs> okay, so we're here at the park. We're going to test out some of the intelligent flight modes that the drone has. Never done it before, so not really sure how it's going to go. And we don't know which buttons to press either. But we're at a big open space. There is. The propeller guards. There is nothing to hit. Look at this thing. Oh, there's an object in the way. Intelligent flight mode number one. We could do a circle or a helix. It's really handy. As soon as it does the intelligent mode, it flies up and away for the video and then flies back to us. How cool is that? Next it's small still. function, we're going to do a circle when it finally comes back. Next one we're going to try is called the helix. Yeah, it goes like that. It's like a tornado. sure what's gonna happen here. <laughs> Let's see what happens. <laughs> this last one is called Astro. Yeah, I'm ready. We're gonna do it, we're gonna do it, we're gonna do it, we're gonna do it, we're gonna do it. This noise we're gonna get used to a lot. It's got low battery. It's low battery. Luckily, there's no ocean near us. Okay, guys, so now I'm gonna go for a run and see how good the active track on this thing is. There it is. There it is there. We're gonna see if it can keep up. So we just figured out that you can get it to active track you. It's pretty good. You can run 
pretty much as fast as you can and it'll still follow you. And also you can control it with your hand. And that is us for the day, so we are gonna bring it in. Cool! First test flight was a success. There's still more modes that we need to do, so we'll check those out next session. <laughs> We're gonna go home now and check out how they came out. <laughs> <laughs>